from the Sports Station, powered by Hamilton Orthopedics Spine and Sports Medicine. Here is News Channel 2 Sports Director, Spencer Davidson. Good evening. A pair of local PGCBL teams met up on the diamond tonight as the Utica Blue Sox took the trip up Route 12 to visit the Boonville Lumberjacks for an East Division battle. To Robert Smith Sports Complex, fourth meeting of the 2023 season between these teams, Utica leads the season series two games to one coming in. And the Sox strike first in the top of the fourth. Runners on the corners for Taylor Kaufman. That's blooped to right center, and it'll drop for a base hit. Andre Demetral scores easily from third, and Utica is on the board. Bottom half of the inning, Jacks respond. They, too, have him on the corners, and the runners go. Pickoff attempt at first, but he's already gone. Throw home can't be handled. Eli Snelson is in safely, and the double steal from Boonville ties it at one. Top five, Sox retake the lead on a throwing error. Then with two on, it's Demetral. Lofts it deep to center. The catch is made. Will Radich tags and scores to give Utica a 3-1 lead. Later in the inning, first and third occupied once again, and Nate McClure chops it past second, getting Peter Adams across the plate for more insurance. Sox took a 4-1 lead. They'd go on to win 6-3 as they've now won 3-4 against Boonville this year. Brandon Scott, 10 strikeouts and the win on the mound for Utica. Elsewhere in the PGCBL tonight, the Mohawk Valley Diamond Dogs split a doubleheader with the Albany Dutchman, losing Game 1 4-1 before bouncing back with a 5-1 win in Game 2 to snap a five-game losing streak. In the NYCBL, the Cheryl Silversmiths dropped their third in the last four, losing 10-7 to the Cortland Crush. RFA graduate Caleb Miller had a day at the plate, though, going 2-3 for three with three RBI for the Smitties in the loss. North American Box Lacrosse League action. The Utica Yeti get back in the win column, beating the Oswego River Hawks 14 to 12 on the road. Gail Thorpe led the offense with two goals and three assists, while Patrick Crosby made 55 saves in the win.